Hello, 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 hello there, beautiful people. Listen up. It's your girl, Sharian. I'm back with the word, the Holy Spirit, the Lord have a word for someone and I'm here to deliver. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So guys, only this morning, early, early, I heard the Lord said, uh, I am going to do it. I am going to do it. This word is for someone that is under the sound of my voice. The Holy Spirit is here. He is present because I can feel his power. I can feel his anointing. God says that he is going to do it. For someone, you're listening to me right now. The Lord has sent me to minister to you his heart. And he's saying to you today, child of God, that he is going to do it. There's something that you have been praying for. There's something that you've been asking God to do in your life. And for some of you, it's not even material thing. Um, but God says he is going to meet you at the point of your need. He is going to do it. He wants you to have faith in him. He's saying to lean into him, lean into him, lean into him. He is going to do it. And so he gave me Ephesians 3.20 for you. And it says, now to him who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we may ask or think according to his power that works in us. There's nothing that your God cannot do. He is a miracle working God. He is going to do it for you, child of God. So lean into him. Expect the unexpected because God is going to come through for you. He is going to do it in the mighty name of Jesus. He also gave me Isaiah 65, 24. And it says, before they call, I will answer. And while they are still speaking, I will hear. The Lord says that he will answer you before you even acts he will answer you because he had it all in mind he had it all prepared it was all set up before this day and so he knows exactly exactly what you need up to this point he knows exactly what you want he knows exactly your heart's desire matter of fact it is him who put the desire in your heart and he sent me here to tell you today child of god Stop praying about it because he is going to do it. He have heard your prayer and he says yes to you. Yes, the answer is yes. It is his will to do it for you. Why wouldn't he want to heal you? Why wouldn't he want to deliver you and your family? Why wouldn't he want to deliver you? Why wouldn't he want to save your family? Why wouldn't he want you to walk in prosperity? It says in the book of John, John 1, 2, Beloved, I wish above all things that thou may prosper and be in good health, even as thy soul prospers. And so this tells me that God wants you to be prosperous. He wants you to live in an abundant life and he wants you to live in good health. Hallelujah. And this prosperity is not only um, material things. It goes beyond this, the wisdom of God, the light of God, all these different things. He wants you to receive his prosperity in every area and in every aspect of your life. Glory be to God. He took me to John 14, 14 as well. And it says, if you ask me anything in my name, I will do it. Anything acts of your father and he will do it. As long as you're walking in his will, as long as you're walking in his purpose for your life, God says today that he will do it. As long it lines up with his will for your life, he will do it. Glory be to God. He also gave me Ezekiel 24, 14, and it says the Lord has spoken it. It shall come to pass and I will do it. I will not go back. God is not a man that he shall lie or the son of man that he shall repent. And so if he said it to you, he will do it. He cannot go back on his word. He will do it. 
And so I just want to say a quick pray for you, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus. I thank you for your word today. I thank you, oh God, that you will do it, that you will satisfy the desire of your children heart according to your will. You will do it because you are a good father. You give beautiful things. And so, Father God, I thank you, oh God, that even now for what we are about to see manifest in the lives of your children. I say thank you, Lord, even now. Father, I ask, oh God, that you will protect this word, that no weapon formed against this word shall prosper. And every tongue that rise against this word in judgment, we condemn it even now. I cut off any demonic entity that would want to hinder this word from going forward in the mighty name of Jesus. I decree and declare that no evil powers of the enemy can stop this word from going forward. I dispatch every angel assigned to this word today. Father God, I thank you, oh God, that you are supplying every need of your children today. I thank you, oh God, for the wisdom. I thank you, oh God, for setting their lives free. I thank you, oh God, for delivering them. I thank you, oh God, for bringing them into prosperity. I thank you, oh God, for bringing them into purpose. I thank you, oh God, for saving their loved ones. I thank you, oh God. For all that you will do in Jesus' mighty name, we pray. And we say amen and amen and amen. So guys, uh, that is the word. You heard uh, the word of the Lord. God says, I will do it. Believe it. Lean in on your father because he will do it. He will not disappoint you. He will not let you down. What he says he will do, he will do in Jesus' mighty name. So guys, that is the word. I thank you all for tuning in. I love you guys with the love of Christ. Stay blessed, stay tuned, and until my next one, bye.